All right, we have 24 minutes for the Aurora to get here. Or Sunbeam, sorry. We have 24 minutes for Sunbeam to get here. I'm looking for the goddamn grapple arm. So I have one other place that I think it might be. And I haven't been there yet, which is, you know, bad. I should have gone there the second I was by that island, but I didn't. Should have done it. So let's go do it. And I'm leaving when my favorite music is playing. Damn, I like this music so much. This one's my favorite, just because it gets all, like, fucking hardcore. Here, let's give it a little listen. That's that good fucking shit right there. That's that classy shit. Anyway, music ends. For we are going back to the mountain. That's where Sunbeam wants to land. Now as we're going up here, I should have done this before, but I didn't. There is wreckage nearby, and that wreckage could possibly have grapple arms. I remember this wreckage kind of well because of the fact that it has one of the best, you know, things in the game. Something that we have, but we can't craft it right now because we don't have enough glass. But um, I could have gotten glass this whole time. I just was focused on the other shit because the story is what I'm focused on right now. I want to progress. Uh, slowly but surely and just enjoy myself. Lead! Hey, I'm sorry, man. When I see fucking lead, I need it. Fucking, this shit is in everything. It's in the fucking vehicles, it's in the fucking upgrades, it's in the base itself and upgrading the base. You need it for fucking everything. Every goddamn thing. takes a very long time to get. I like how it says insulates against radiation like we're gonna be in radioactive areas all the time. Oh wait no there's more. Ah, Bubba! Ah, Bubba's in my fucking space. He likes to get in my space. Cause he's a big old doggy. He don't know that he's so big. Big ass dog. Yeah, let me grab all this. Take me like two seconds. Ooh. Bubba, seriously bro. You need to like move over a bit. Goddamn. All over my feeties. Ooh, inventory full. Uh, everything is valuable. I guess the salt. Sorry, salt. Lithium is more important to me. Oops. There you go. And that is why I gave him so much goddamn storage. Ignore that. <laughs> Ignore that building. <laughs> we'll get to that soon enough. Very soon. Most likely next episode. Now around these mountains, there are leviathans. There are reapers all over the place. And the reason why is not only because of this mountain, to kind of keep you away a little bit, but also because the loot here is pretty nice. You know, you get diamonds, you get lithium, you know, you get a... Uh, Probably aggro gel too, if we can find it. And more importantly, this fucking thing. We can get alien confinement. And I know what you're thinking, like, alien confinement, you already have that. Well, yeah, I didn't, you know, I didn't go about the normal way. I got the alien confinement from another thing. So, yeah. 
There's other ways to get the alien confinement, but the main way is uh, through here. This is the best way to do it. Alright, let's get inside. See if we can find any fucking shit. See if we can find the grapple arm. Uh, modification station. Uh, torpedo arm again with the torpedo arms. It's like motherfucker. Torpedo arm again. Oh, here we go. Prawn suit. Look at this. You used to be able to scan these, and these used to give you prawn suit parts. This is probably the only other way to uh, get prawn suit stuff is from these wreckages. And it used to be uh, you could come here and get a whole bunch but they changed it up they made it to where you can't do that another torpedo arm but no grapple arm there's another prawn suit this would make two prawn suits if you went to the previous uh, thing so you just need two more if you wanted to get the prawn suit without having to go through the aurora which is pretty cool uh, let's see Uh, where did we come from? That way, okay. Go back through here. Go back this way. This way, and out. Oh, wait, oh. Wait, no, this doesn't connect to the other thing. Cyclops thermal thing. New blueprint acquired. That's cool. So we got the thermal thing. That's a pretty rare one. Wall shelves. Near blueprint acquired. Double decker bed. Near blueprint acquired. Please observe safety protocol CSP 21 before handling classified cargo. Shut your bitches up. Alright, so still no grapple arm. And we're full on inventory. Great. So I. Oh yeah, is that it, or is that another torpedo arm? No, that's just that's a bioreactor. Not bioreactor. That's a nuclear reactor. Interesting. Is that a torpedo arm? <gasps> grapple suit. Let's go. All right, this is the grapple. There's another one. Blueprint acquired. Oh, there you go. Now we have the grapple arm. And we only scanned one of them, so that means we probably scanned one in this thing. I thought we scanned all torpedo arms, but I guess there was a grapple arm in there. Alright. Maybe we scanned a grapple arm earlier? I don't fucking remember. Oh, wait, no, yeah, we did. We scanned a grapple arm earlier, but we only found one. So that would be two and three. So, yeah. See, all the grapple arms are here. Oh, look. I was about to say, like, fucking, like, where's the rest of the grapple arms? And they're all here. Make sure that guy doesn't follow me. And I believe over here, this is the pride and joy of this place. This is what you're actually after. So water can be really annoying. But in this one building here, is this torpedo? Yeah. Uh, there's one more grapple arm. Or one more prawn suit arm based thing, but it's a <laughs> stupid one. Anyway, oh there it is. I was to say. Get this one. This is what you want. If you want infinite water. There you go. New blueprint acquired. Is that more water? Okay, just drink it. So that suit right there, that basically takes water from your body and converts it into new water. So you basically get unlimited water, which is really nice. There you go, and then the front suit thing. New blueprint acquired. And that should be it. Yeah, so this one is pretty easy. This one's just like an easy way in, and then you get water filtration. The water filtration suit is meant to be pretty easy to get to because, you know, who wants to deal with water? 
Nobody. Is that another bronze? No, that's a nuclear reactor. And now we have the nuclear reactor. Welcome aboard, Captain. Nuclear reactor is a bit of a tricky one because it's not just one blueprint, it's multiple. You actually get the nuclear reactor itself and, as an added bonus, you get uh, nuclear reactor rods, which will be added with the thing, so that way you can craft them and power it up. So let's get away from that guy before he turns around and bites me in the ass. Yeah, I don't want to deal with that guy. It's also getting dark, so I don't want to deal with any leviathans right now. I just want to get the fuck out of here. More lead, I see that. I'll come back for you, baby. Don't worry. That's silver. I thought that was more lead. Uh, I don't know if that's the drop-off. No, that is not the drop-off. That's the void, yeah. Let's avoid that, thanks. Yeah, I don't want to fucking go down that hole. That's the void. That looked like the uh, volcanic crater, but it's not. The volcanic crater is this way. So I almost went into the void unwillingly. <laughs> I thought I was going correctly. That would have been funny. <laughs> you fall down, welcome to Paris, bitch. Not Paris, welcome to Brazil. Or whatever the joke was, I don't fucking remember. I never got that joke. I never got the Brazil thing. Like, is that supposed to be like a bad thing? Like, I don't get it. Is that like a fucking map or something? Because people are like, oh, I don't want to go in Brazil and TF2. That's what I thought the joke was. Maybe it is that. Because Brazil in uh, TF2 is like a big open area. You can't hide. So if a sniper is there, you're just dead. You're just fucked. It's like, good luck. Maybe that's the joke. Because it's like in Brazil, it's like a big open area. With like mountains and shit for snipers, I guess. Maybe. <laughs> Maybe. Now we have 12 minutes. In these 12 minutes, we have a choice. We can go to Sunbeam and do Sunbeam shit. Or. Welcome aboard, Captain. We can just wait him out. That's what I'm gonna do. Build another storage unit. build another storage unit. We're going to put that one in there. All the titanium. Oh my god. All this. Don't care. In fact, let's upgrade our fucking cyclops because I just realized we can do that now. We just need two rubies. There you go. Two rubies is in the rubies we don't already have in our inventory. Give me all that. Give me all that. In fact, just go in the Cyclops, because what I want to do is I want to ride the Cyclops towards the mountain. Welcome aboard, Captain. All systems online. Yeah, it didn't take any damage, I'm about to say. <laughs> Craft this. Turn on the engine. Engine powering up. Engine ready to go. Depth module acquired. Then all we gotta do is just upgrade that depth module. So let's see how deep we can actually go. Mach 2 requires another palestel ingot and three nickel. Three nickel. And another palace stealing it. Fuck. You got any uh, shit in you? No. <laughs> I fucked myself. Good job. <laughs> Alrighty. Let's make our way over there now. Rig for Simon Ronnie. Get away from the ghost Leviathan. Big baby. I 
it flagged emergency speed. Warning, vessel calculated. Excessive noise. The head standard. I wish there was splashes when the Cyclops like surfaces. This is probably my favorite part about the Cyclops is that you're basically able to like just patrol the surface and just enjoy yourself. It's really nice. Ready to watch a show? I know I am. <laughs> I'm ready for this shit. So this is how you would normally find the island, is that this thing would show you where to go. And it'd bring you right to the shore, right to the area of the gateway. And once you see that, you know you're ready to go. And it's in the day? Hell yeah. We're just gonna leave Dean in there. Damn it, all of our power cells are bad. Down. Over. Grab. Oh, wait a minute. Over. To the thing. Replace. Nice. What else can we make? Uh, shield generator is a power cell plus a polyline plus advanced wiring kit. Fine. Uh, three magnet site and a computer chip. Fine. All that's fine. We can do all that shit now. Anyway, time for my show. We're gonna save. And I'm going to cut away when the message plays. All I'm gonna do is get inside Dean and walk away. In fact, since we saved, I wanna see something else. I wanna see if Dean is affected by the glitch. I wanna see if he is. Cause normally people wouldn't get this close to this thing. You know, normally people would like stay far away and like stay on the outskirts, but I'm wondering if Dean is affected. Cause if Dean's affected, then this is a big ass bug that needs fixing. I'm pretty sure it won't. Don't, don't, I was wrong. Oh, and it doesn't count as water. <laughs> Subnautica? More like Landotica. <laughs> Welcome to Landotica, where there's a bunch of flying creatures. This is amazing. <laughs> you can even see the damage we left behind. <laughs> Look, get them. That is fucked. This is fucked. I like it. That's why I saved, so that way I could fucking see if this works. And it does, so that means we can technically... Ooh, and it still counts? Oh, he's completely landlocked. That's fucked. I love it. That's amazing. He's 100% landlocked now. Because I think the only other way to like recover this is to die and then come back. We'll have to test that out eventually, too. I want to test that uh, someday, but not right now. I just wanted to see it because obviously we're saving anyway, so like, yeah. Look at the fucking Reaper, man. <laughs> fucking, I love this so much. Just seeing Reapers do their thing, like without any like thing to block your vision is so cool. This is what I like about Subnautica is just the vision. If you have unlimited vision, you can see everything. 
Hey, Vsauce, Ember here. What the fuck is over here? There's grapple arms, I'm gonna be pissed. I don't remember this wreckage. We're gonna have to come back for it, because I already fucking fell. If there's grapple arms in there, I'm gonna be pissed. There's some... I think that's lead. Yep, more lead. Okay, so I know where the lead is. It's all around this area. Cool. Is this technically dunes, or is this still mountain? I think this is still mountain. There's no way you can actually grab me. Fucking, if he can grab me, I'm gonna be so sad. <laughs> it would be cool if this was fully invincible, but I doubt it, because if the Leviathan can attack you even in this state, then it's not worth it. Anyway. I'm just gonna look around, fuck it. Okay, there's a time capsule here, okay. And now, since we're technically saved... Nah, you know what, nah, I'm not gonna double back save, fuck that. <laughs> fuck that, I will just come back for it. And it's safer. Looks like we're gonna have to jump. Wee. Can I go towards the thing? I want to see it as I fall. Ooh, oh, that's a gross texture. Oh, we're under the map. <laughs> like I kind of see the aurora. We. Oh, wait a minute. Uh-oh. <laughs> that might be spoilery over in that corner. <laughs> there's, there's something in that corner that might be spoilery. <laughs> I didn't know it was right there. I thought it was a little farther into the map, but that's okay. This is really cool. I like this. I love this glitch. Now, you might be thinking, oh, I'm gonna fall forever. But no, the devs thought this out. Originally... If you fall beyond a certain point, 30,000 meters, the game would shake your screen, you'd glitch the fuck out, and then you'd unstuck yourself back to spawn. However, they changed that number recently, because I I remember they changed it probably around like in 2022 when I was playing this game. Maybe 2021, I can't remember when I was playing this game again. Might be 2020, actually, I can't. I can't wrap my mind around it, but I remember... Right around that time, they updated the game and had a little bit more, you know, stuff in it with the table coral and all that. And then uh, they changed the meters from 30,000 to just 8,000 meters. I believe it was 8,000. It might be 9,000 meters, but they did change it because I remember. And... Shukaka! Oh, we're still glitched. <laughs> we're still glitched. Anyway, it'll teleport you back to a random part of the shallows. And it chose this one, which is like right next to like our base or whatever. So that's pretty nice. I like how it's like right over here. So yeah, it teleports you like right around the shallows area, right around where your spawn is. And then you have to like find your way back. So anyway, let's see what happens. Excuse me? Picking up orbital transport. Oh, there you go. Of trading vessel Sunbeam. Vessel is approaching planet oh, no. surface and no. oh. surface scanning procedures. Detecting massive power surge from anomalous contact. En energy discharge detected. Vessel signature lost. So that's alternative one, where if you're not there, you get a message. So
So what happens if you are there? Now you don't have to be right next to the thing. You can be pretty close. I think it's like maybe 200 meters, something like that. You could technically even be in the water when it happens, but uh, you just gotta be close enough to where the sunbeam can detect you. I didn't even put in my thing. Hang on, let me put in the thing. Let me put in the thing. Let me drop off some materials because I have too much shit in my inventory. I don't know why I didn't just put it away. Welcome aboard, Captain. All systems online. Good. Thank you. I remember what I was doing now. Uh... I can't make it because I don't have enough titanium. Okay. Never mind. I was trying to make a ingot, but we don't have enough. Unless it's in here. Nope. Turn those into copper wires. Okay, so depth module will need three nickel, power steel ingot, plus the original, then we can upgrade it. But let's just put it in now, because like you can see how de deep you can go. I think it's like plus 200 meters to that. Yeah, so it's 500 plus 300 meters, so now you can go down 900 meters, which is Lost River territory. You know what? You know what? Bring Dean. Dean deserves a show. Dean's been inside the fucking thing. Dean went through a fucking whole entire mission. Margaret can see it from where she is. She's fine. Margaret's kind of a stay-at-home mom. She don't really want to adventure. <laughs> She's like, fuck it. <laughs> I don't really want to go anywhere. <laughs> Sorry, Margaret. <laughs> I wish the Cyclops could carry both of them, but no. I can only carry one. Anyway. Besides, you'll help me stand on top of you so I can see. So, this large building... We've seen this before, and it's just standing there. We also got the purple tablet and all that. We've explored some of this mountain. You know, there's some fucking lithium and diamonds inside. You know, there's trees and all that. This makes a pretty decent looking base. You know, like, you can just grab trees and just eat it and enjoy yourself. That tree will never come back. We have now destroyed the entire world for food. Huh? 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 Yeah, <laughs> slightly higher. <laughs> It's honestly quite beautiful. You got Big Bertha just chilling, relaxing, enjoying self. I kind of want to make her purple, actually. I think Margaret's purple. Damn. I might have fucked up the colors. I'll have to double check what I did uh, in a previous life. Or we can just keep it as the new colors. Because this is definitely Dean's new colors. I don't remember Dean be ever being green except for the Below Zero stuff. This is what I made Dean in Below Zero. So. New Dean. He's vibing. Check it out. He's just vibing. He's just inching down. Being a Chad.
Why he vibrating like that? What he doing? <laughs> he just head bobbing. He's just enjoying himself. <laughs> uh, what other shit do we have in the thing? I think we pinned a few things, but let me see. Yeah, we need that. Keep those pinned. Yeah, I know it's quiet. Yeah, I know I haven't done shit. But you know, this is the game. I'm just gonna have to accept it. Mach 3. Didn't we already do Mach 3? No, he did Mach 2. That's not a building. <laughs> That's a gun. Survivor, we see you. Man, I don't know how you held out down there. Hello. We broke an atmosphere and we're descending towards the landing site. Is that a building down there? What do you mean you can't identify it? Hold on. No turning back now. Positions, everyone. Touching down in 10, 9, 8. <laughs> it's coming from the building? Change course. Set thrusters to full. was totally wicked! Why can't Ancient Gears be like this? This is what Ancient Gears need. Damn! That's what I call a fucking counter trap. That's what ancient gears need. So second you fucking activate a monster effect, fuck you, pop. Sunbeam is obliterated. There is no other way off this fucking island or ocean or planet. All because of that gun. Dean, I know what we're gonna do today. We're gonna go touch that gun. <laughs> Let's go do it. <laughs> 